Patients come to CDI to have images done on the Aero scanner. When we're ready, we come and get you for your MR exam. Follow me. Thank you. We're going to bring you back to our changing area for patients where we have every patient change into scrub pants and a gown, and then we proceed to take them into the MR suite for their procedure. Before we get started, I just want to make sure you have nothing implanted in your body, no valves, no stents. The Aero scanner is considerably more open than a traditional scanner. It's nice and short compared to traditional scanners and it's more open than traditional scanners. So patients are much more comfortable on the Aero scanner. Not every exam is the same. It's very specialized to the procedure that you're having and the type of coil that we might be using. When you come in to have an MR procedure of the head, we're going to have you laying on the table on your back. Your head's going to be resting in a cushion inside of a head coil. We're going to be giving you some headphones to help reduce the sound of the machine. We'll give you some music to listen to. We also like to give you a security squeeze ball. If for some reason at any time a patient is not comfortable, all they have to do is squeeze that ball and we come right in when we bring them out. We don't like to leave the room unless we know the patient is very comfortable. Then we'll go ahead and we'll position the head coil over the patient and then we'll send them into the scanner if they're ready. A coil is very important because it interacts with the MR scanner and it helps to acquire the images. Without the coil that we're using, we're not able to obtain any images. When a patient at CDI has an MRI of the shoulder, they are going to be going into the scanner head first. We'll put a cushion under the knees to help make them comfortable. Their shoulder is going into a coil and their arm is going to be positioned down along their side. And once we have them positioned, we send them into the scanner and get the images that we need. is one of the easiest MRIs to have. You're going in feet first and it's a relatively short MRI. They're gonna be laying on the table on their back and their knee's gonna go in a special knee coil. And whatever we're imaging for MRI, whatever part's being imaged goes to the center. So with the MRI of the knee, the knee goes to the center of the scanner so their head is not in the machine. Most patients are able to get through an MRI very comfortably. Really great job today, Mary. Your MRI turned out perfect. Good.